Welcome. I'm Sheila Cox, President of Select Temp Employment Services. I want to personally thank you for choosing us. This next bit of information is to help you be as successful as possible as we match your talent with our opportunities. Please sit back, pay attention. Should you have any questions at the end of the video, please contact your local Select Temp representative. Thank you. Select Temp Employment Services has created this program to address accidents and injury hazards for temporary workers. While office work may not be the most dangerous occupation, safety and health hazards do exist. Education and awareness can help prevent office injuries and illnesses. Emergency Evacuation your host employer should orient you to the physical layout of the office with particular attention to emergency exits. Become familiar with emergency alarms and equipment. You should read the host employer's emergency action plan to learn where you must report and what you must do in a variety of situations. If your office assignment calls for you to enter a plant floor area, know that layout as well. Back safety and ergonomics. Sitting in an office chair for long periods of leaning and slouching can put more stress on the back than standing and lifting. That's why it's important to maintain good posture to balance the natural curves of your spine. Here are some tips. Use a chair with lumbar or lower back support. You can use a rolled up towel if the chair does not have built in support. Adjust the chair so your arms are desk height and your upper legs are horizontal. You may need support under your thighs just behind your knees. Your feet should rest flat on the floor. Use a footrest if needed. Sit with your weight forward. Avoid sudden jerky motions in your chair by planning your movements. When you move, avoid twisting your torso and move your whole body when you turn. Turn with your feet and hips to face your destination. If you drop something, slide to the edge of your chair and place one hand on either your desk or your knee with one foot in front of you. This supports and balances your body as you retrieve the item. Plan to take periodic rest breaks and get up from your chair. It's a good idea to gently stretch and walk around. The top of your computer monitor should be at your eye level. A fancy monitor platform or an old phone book will raise the monitor to the correct height. Position your keyboard directly in front of you, never at your side or on your lap. Desk height should allow you to bend your arms at a 90 degree angle. This is your normal natural work posture. Position your computer keyboard so that your wrists remain neutral or unbent when you type. Use wrist rests as a guide for your wrists while keyboarding, not as a spot to plant their weight. Tilt the monitor so overhead lights do not reflect and strain your eyes. If you do use a copy stand, place it as close to and at the same level as your monitor. This reduces eye movement and fatigue by shortening the distance between copy and screen. If you spend a lot of time on the phone, use a headset. It keeps your hands free for the keyboard and prevents awkward positions trying to phone and type at the same time. Finally, plan rest breaks that permit you to leave your workstation for a few minutes. Short breaks and body position changes allow your eyes, hands, arms, and back to rest. Machine guarding and use. Do not operate office equipment unless you have been trained to do so. When using machines, make sure all guards remain in place. Do not wear long hair, clothing, or jewelry that could get caught in moving parts. You should store items in an appropriate place, such as a file cabinet or a storage room. Use ladders when retrieving materials from shelves. Never stand on a box, chair, or other unsuitable item. Get help with heavy loads. Break them into smaller loads for convenience and safety. Use carts or dollies whenever they are available. Please use this program as a basic introduction and guideline to potential hazards in this type of work. Select Temp does not intend this program to replace more detailed training called for by federal or state regulations or by company policies. Our hope is that you found the information covered in the safety video you just viewed to be worthy of your time and energy. 
After watching our safety videos, we hope that you are in alignment with SelectTemp's belief that your safety is paramount to us and should also be to you. Do not lose sight of the fact that you are, in almost every case, in charge of your own safety. Take it seriously and do all you can to keep you and your coworkers safe. Do not hesitate to call us if you are ever concerned about yours or a coworker's safety. We always recommend that you speak to a site supervisor. However, should that not be an option, we are always available to discuss your safety. It is imperative that if you are injured on the job, you notify us as soon as possible. We want to be certain that you are routed in the proper direction should you decide you need to seek medical attention. We also want to be sure that you understand the process once entering the workers' compensation process. We would like to take a moment and be sure you understand what we expect from you and what you can expect from your partnership with SelectTemp. Number one, you are not obligated to accept any job we offer you. Ask questions. Be certain you have all the information you need before making the commitment. If you do commit to the job offered, please be there. Do the job to the best of your ability. If you are unable to make it for any reason, call us. Communication is vital to this being a successful partnership. We rely on you communicating with us so that we can communicate with our customers. Number two, if your assignment ends for whatever reason, call us. Let us know you are once again available and we will do all we can to place you in an opportunity that matches your talent. Number three, our work week runs Monday through Sunday. You are responsible on the majority of the assignments for entering your time into our PeopleNet system. Your SelectTemp representative will ensure you have all of the information you need upon acceptance of your assignment. Number four, paydays are every Thursday. Your pay will either be direct deposited into an account of your choosing or it will be deposited onto a cash card for your convenience. You will choose which is the best option for you. Number five, it will never be Select Temp's intention to place you in any environment that you are not treated in a respectful fashion. Should you find yourself in a situation that is not in alignment with that intent, please contact us immediately. On the flip side, we ask that every Select Temp employee treat anyone they encounter on the work site with the utmost respect in their dealings as well. Last but certainly not least, this is a partnership. We are here to discuss any concerns you might have or any successes you want to share. Do not hesitate to call us.